this video actually it, it hits extremely close to home uh kind of uh Pandir's box was a a actual Valentinian Gnostic. I hope he sees this. This is his equivalent to my or to the Eastern Orthodox St. Anthony's Monastery. <laughs> it's funny. The Greek churches in America actually go to St. Anthony's Monastery <laughs> and they have these wild mean like monks that are like they believe in the toll houses and they're all like Archbishop Lazar just totally smashes the hell out of them just like they're they're not they're Ephraimites they're not they're not Orthodox I actually wound up calling a couple a couple St. Anthony's nuns Ephraimites and they got kicked uh, but no it it's kind of funny because, yeah, the no the it shows gnosis symbols of of uh, what the Gnostics actually believe, and then you have Mithraism, which was the accusation of the Gnostics against the Catholics, saying that they were the that they were mixing and you know. Or what the Gnostics claim that the Catholics were Serenthus. Um it, and this is according to the chief Gnostic on here. Uh, well, I guess there would be there would be two. There would be James at Pandir's box and Life, Liberty, Love. But I don't. There is not a single person who comes with Gnostic on here that can rival Pandir's box. Uh, just in well, I mean, I would love to see somebody take up the challenge. But the video flashes from there's a serpent mentioned here, and there's a serpent mentioned here. So the serpent must be. It's like I. You know that was a common animal, right? And the Gnostics didn't see the serpent as the devil. They saw him as the, the good god coming in and actually rescuing uh, mankind who had been enslaved or instilling in them the spirit, which is actually it's kind of almost orthodox in a way but, well, you could view evolution took place, and then God, uh, the God of spirituality, came down and imbued his spirit into this basically very complex ape. This would be a very modern Gnostic view. Uh, and then, yeah, you could, you could, uh, See, I'm trying. I'm trying to work the Gnostic for you, and in, in this, I'm trying to do the work for you in this video because you throw mushrooms in with uh, pictures of Mithraism, which uh, Christianity. It, it was it was vying, but they were vying in different <clears throat> in areas. The only thing was um, the birth date. And it was already Saturnalia for like what four hundred years, so everybody was claiming that date. Uh, and the uh, the Christians complaining that we have early Christian writings complaining that the Mithra cult was stealing their their ideas. Um. And then there's the picture of the crucified Jesus in heaven. Well, they didn't. They thought the Christ. They they put their faith in Christ, and Jesus was only the man, so that they didn't 
think that the Christ got crucified. Which kind of defeats the Moses on the, I don't know. It's kind of funny how the West has made serpents to be, there's the devil. No. Actually, serpents were signs of, they are actually, uh, seen as something very good. Uh, and it only, the serpent only killed the stupid. Uh, and they, they, uh, even, even up until modern times, it was good to have snakes. Like, oh, you're the snake in the garden. Well, anybody who's ever had a garden, a snake is a good thing. Because it doesn't eat any of your plants, and it kills all the pests. So a serpent in the garden is actually a fantastic thing to have. But if you put 666 on it, even though the book of Revelations was rejected by the Orthodox Church, I want to be getting an argument. But the person who made this video doesn't know what Aphromites are. They don't know what St. Anthony's Monster is. They don't know what the Orthodox Church is. Uh, so me talking about how the Aphromites are not Orthodox and they're seen as like just a bunch of angry old men who hate themselves and are Gnostic, well at least severely ascetic and, and docetic, you know, docetic in their their view of the flesh is evil and there's no, there's no there's the flesh is terrible and the spirit needs to be freed from the flesh, which is pretty hardcore Gnostic. I don't know. Again, I'm talking to some, I'm, I'm making a video response to somebody who mixes uh, images of Mithra or the Trinoctony of, of Mithra mushrooms, various types of mushrooms. Uh, different biblical pictures and then passages out of the Old Testament which was the Demiurge so you're listening to the de and he's <laughs> you're going to the wrong source no. I don't know it just doesn't end you can't can you pick up a book And I'm not slamming this person to oh yeah cool video I'm gonna piss off piss off anybody who's who believes in Christianity okay it didn't work on me I actually kind of thought it was cool I got a kick out of it so I don't know I'm gonna vote up I'm gonna vote thumbs up on this one <laughs> I think I might favorite it I don't know I kind of need to see that video right now.